Hello high school friends, welcome back to another new video. So today, well I already filmed the video, I'm currently editing it right now but I hated the intro so bad so I'm gonna redo it again but today I'm gonna go and show you guys some houseplants that I got at Walmart, a houseplant haul and these are basically honestly all ferns but they're so pretty and I just want to share them with you guys because like they were $3.94 and they're just beyond gorgeous so make sure you go to your local Walmart if you can and go and check out if they have this shipment because like Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you'd like to see more. Also, we now have channel memberships, so if you'd like to get more information all about that good, plenty stuff, I'll have the links down below. Alrighty, without any further ado, let's go and, um, well, let me go and show you the plants that I got. So, I, uh, this is number one, well, they're not in order, but this is the first one that I got. So, I believe this is called a blue fern, and all of these plants were for $3.94. There is a name tag, and $3.94, and it's from Better Homes, I believe. No, Expert Gardener. Which honestly, I think it's like Walmart's brand. They're like, they're so affordable. And what is this on the leaves? Double checking that there's no bugs. <laughs> and the new plant that I got. But isn't it so stunning and so cute? By the way, a lot of these plants, they're all from, <laughs> they're all ferns. And if you know me, I kill ferns. I mean, I do have a couple ferns. For example, bird's nest ferns. So those are really easy to look after. I think that's the only fern that I have. I mean, asparagus fern but it's not a fern it has the word on it but it's not considered a fern okay so this was really really cute i like it a lot it like it really cute. so yeah it was a pretty good sale and it wasn't any shipments they were still in the boxes and i did a made a mess i put everything back where it belonged i did have to like look throughout the boxes i think i, I posted on my yeah I, I ended up posting a little bit on my instagram stories uh it was only like four medium-sized boxes but yeah this was the first one that i got and i'm honestly in love so they had all these plants also ivies and african violets but i didn't got those because like i'm a, i don't want an ivy i mean they're beautiful but I, I'm, I'm satisfied right now and african violets are really easy to look after i say easy oh my god what am i talking about <laughs> they're really hard to look after well like you know for me like i struggle to look after african violets okay so the next one is this one i don't know what it's named but it does look similar to this next plant that i was going to show y'all i'm pretty sure these are two different plants uh maybe from the same family because they do have like the same color and almost foliage except this one looks like this and then this one on its tips has like a little bit of like the finger type of vibe for example like my burst nest fern um there's like a basic one that looks just like a burst nest fern and then there's another one that it's also a burst nest fern it has its own name i don't know what it's called but it has like a fingers on the tip of its leaves just like this one Anywho, I think this is a really, really beautiful plant. I'm gonna probably need to like do some research on its name and how to look after it. Usually all ferns are low light, can tolerate low light conditions and sometimes prefer to be in low light conditions as well. I know they, <laughs> they need their soil to be moist and their environment to be very humid, which is why I have a humidifier now and they're gonna be moist all the goddamn time. Um, not wet, but I'm gonna be looking after their soils very consistent and possibly oh i forgot i also have a rabbit wood fern i forgot about that one um but yeah this is really really pretty as you guys can see i honestly love its leaves let me get out of the front so i can focus actually really good uh i think this would look so pretty like in a nice fancy pot but um oh my god my girl like <laughs> and then here's the other one which looks so nice get out of the frame look at that y'all and just like to show you how they look side by side uh and um see super cute now the last one i was not gonna get i was oh my god i keep i keep knocking over my god and girl like because i'm done uh sorry i know some people don't like when i say that okay the next one i was not gonna get because i was pretty satisfied with these and that one which let me show you i wasn't gonna get it because like I don't know my grandma got it and it just died on her like they don't they don't belong indoors i mean the light is okay but like, like you know low light conditions but like indoors is usually very dry our humidity is between 30 sometimes even drier than that or the highest on inside of a house is like 50 um average so these prefer like 80 <laughs> percent humidity or even more um thank god this plant room I can get, I mean, with these humidifiers, y'all, I can boost it up all the way to 100% humidity. Uh, <laughs> but I don't want to do that because I did research and that's not really good to do. And also because of mold and fungus and we don't want that stuff in our plants. Um, yes, this is our plants. <laughs> but, uh, so yeah, I'm going to give this plant room, I think I have it at 80% humidity. 
So it's currently 76% humidity on this side. This side is 69 and then that side behind y'all, it's 78. Oh no, it went to 77. Also, just to let y'all know, and like, doesn't that make, like, isn't that crazy? So like, you know, around the room is like different humidity. And also there's a lot of plants in here, so that helps a lot. And these doors are open because like, I don't want it to get too cloudy in this room. So I'm letting it go, but yeah. And also I'm pretty sure like the plants, which I'm not really gonna get them for the humidity, but it's, you know, it's gonna help boost the humidity in the house because there's some other benefits like softer skin and stuff like that. Anywho, so I saw this plant a while back, um, a lot of times and the big boxes when I used to film plant shopping videos and it was pretty affordable. They sold it for like the lowest that it sold was three dollars and ninety-four cents. A very small inch pot, though. I think I can give you guys an example since I buy so many um, Costa Fine pots. Okay, let me see. Do I have? Yeah, here, here it is. You know, like in these small little containers, which I believe these are three point five inch pots. Um, it says ten ounces, but y'all get the point. Like these are the smaller ones, and then other times I also see them in the bigger pots, which are these. Um, not the plant side. I just I like to reuse my pots because like why not? <laughs> Same the environment, right? Um, I think I took off the main tag, but yeah, so and let me show you like comparison Comparison Lord have mercy. Uh, so yeah, I usually see these and what well, that fern and these pots and the big box stores I never buy them because like I told y'all um, I hate ferns <laughs> and um I hate them, I, it's a love and a hate relationship and I give up with them um, or to them until now because like I can't keep them alive and but now I think I can because like I said a lot of humidity in the plant room now um, and they're just so beautiful like I love them so much because like they're just so they really give off that tropical vibe in your house and I ugh, like I know some people like to decorate the house there's a lot of different aesthetics out there. My aesthetic that I just enjoy <laughs> it's the jungle vibe basically having plants all over the place like i even wanted on my toilet i don't know about the toilet but y'all get the point like i want it everywhere and if my boyfriend wasn't here and i lived by myself in this apartment there will be plants every inch of the apartment and my, i think my pastel is ready but yeah so this is a really cute fern i like it a lot and um if i can keep these girlies alive i think i deserve myself a reward to buy that big boston fern you know the basic fern that everybody almost kills um if you live in dry environments if you live like in hawaii or corpus christi like y'all must like have these like weeds out there like in your house because like it's very humid but here in texas y'all it's really dry uh, <laughs> except in the summer it gets really humid um anywho so i love it so much we are gonna take off the wrappers but i'm gonna check out my pasta oh my god so i just finished eating <laughs> on my lunchy break <laughs> and um Am I the only one, like, whenever you get full, you know, in your tummy, and then you get sleepy? No? Just me? Okay. <laughs> uh, I'm already, I already had a double special shot already, and um, I'm still sleepy, so we're gonna get another one. Like, baby, one is not enough. We need more caffeine. <laughs> I'm fine, y'all. Also, let's not talk about the angle. <laughs> Literally, I'm, I'm filming this video today. Oh my god, sorry. And I'm gonna post it today because, like, I want to put a video out today. And, like, I really, really want to stay on top of my content. It's just hard. They can be complaining, like, always. Okay, so we're gonna open the little thingy thingies. And I know I have a little bit of water. Oh my god. So I'm only gonna, like, open it very little. It's because, like, I don't want to expose it. I kind of like the plastic because it. it <laughs> Wait, that's a lot. I'm lying. Okay, I thought it was like on a bag. You know what I'm saying? But no, it's um, it's just wrapped. Let me just like it's exposed in the bottom. Does that make sense? Um, because I really do like these containers because like they trap the water and hold on, easy watering wick system. Check window. Check window for water level. Everybody has those fancy pots, um, which are pretty cheap. Like all plants have it, but like it has it already, and it's a fern, which makes it like. It just makes it so much easier. Y'all, oh my god. Okay, that's really good. And for three ninety four. Like, are you kidding? Okay, let's open it. Ah! Oh my god. Sorry. God, you're beautiful. Ay, Dios mío, mirate. Espérate. Mira. Está muy bonita la cosa. You just got a text. Uh, okay. <laughs> look at this. Like, y'all, look at the leaves. 
Wait, my big nose is in the way. <laughs> but look at that. Oh my God. I am so gonna take Instagram pictures with this. <laughs> oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I love it, I love it, I love it. I love it so much. I'm gonna kill it, I swear to God. No, I wanna manifest. <laughs> I'm gonna manifest and I'm gonna keep it alive. Okay, this one's a little bit more basic, but she is so gorgeous. It has like a very like blue, gray. Blue, gray, green, green, gray. Yeah, like a green and a gray combination kind of a color, but it's beautiful. And I got a burp, excuse me. Okay, I feel better. <laughs> oh my God, why does it feel like Christmas? Like, what is it? Ah! Oh my God, I'm so in love with it. And the containers, it has, I didn't even show you. Oh my God, I'm so dumb. Give me a second. Okay, so basically it has this. Y'all see that? And this is a little window that it's talking about. Okay, if I want to take it off, is there like a little pot? Hold on. Like, orange pot <laughs> okay is that a it feels like plastic but hey it works so oh let me show you okay so here it is yeah we love her oh my god uh, it's beautiful i mean it's almost beautiful but she's still gorgeous Oh my god, I kind of want to go back and get more. Because we're, we're getting a cold front, y'all. And like, they're going to put them outside. Uh. <laughs> Why didn't they do that shit? And it's going to get damaged. Clearance? No, I'm kidding. They, they rarely put their plants on clearance. Like, they look like trash. Ooh, ooh. What the? That is so weird. Okay. Oh, I'm making a mess, but I got to vacuum anyways. It's just the soil is like moist, so. I don't know if I can vacuum that up. I gotta pick it up by hand. Oh, this one has two. There's water dripping over here. Let's take a the angle in this video is so bad. But welcome to my channel. <laughs> I love it. Uh... <coughs> Excuse me. No, like, I really, really do love it a lot, y'all. It's just, it's really dirty. Let me get some paper towels. Okay. Cochino. Oh, now it's beautiful. <laughs> ah, the other one's way prettier, though. I mean, this one's really cool, though. It's cool. But it's not gorgeous like the other one. This one just... Gives me the oofs. Se mira un poquito como hierba, pero me gusta mucho. Looks kind of like a weed, like in the backyard, you know what I'm saying? But it's still beautiful. It gives me, it gives it that vibe, you know what I'm saying? That tropical vibe that I love. Okay, this one's really, really cute. Um, oh my god. Oh my god, the coffee. <laughs> Yo, this angle is like so bad. Oh my god. It makes my forehead so big. Okay. Here is the air plants. I literally knocked over the air plants by accident, but I found it. So <laughs> I'm gonna put it right there. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah. Oh my god. It's so gorgeous. <laughs> I mean, you're a little bit. Mm. Mm. We got a little bit of a mess already. I swear to God, if it makes a mess, I'm gonna get so mad. As in, like, you know, <laughs> when these plants are not happy, y'all, they drop leaves like crazy. <sighs> so I'm gonna make sure she's happy. Oh, let me extend it more. Oh, come on, queen. She said I'm different. <laughs> One second. Okay. I love it so much. I need coffee, y'all. Give me a second. Mmm. I didn't even do a thumbnail. So I know I said I was gonna do other stuff in this video, but um, the video's already long. So <laughs> We're in, this is pretty much it. Basically like a haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Ooh, I'm basically doing the thumbnail right now, hold on. Alrighty guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.